Oh, all right, ladies and gentlemen, this isn't going to be fun because I've got to change gears and shit. So let's see how this goes. Um, it is a new day. Welcome back to another video. We are currently on ways to the gym. I knew that was going to happen, but you know, I still did it anyway. Um, we are on ways to the gym. We're going to get the sauna stuff done uh, now. Hold on, I'm going to hold you here just really quickly while I do this. I should not be doing this while I drive, but it is what it is, I'm doing it anyway. Um, we're on our way to the gym to go to the sauna to um, kind of give my back a bit more relief. Um, I feel, all right, why did that do that? I feel really well, like, feel. I feel a lot better this morning, um, taking some painkillers and stuff last night and doing what I had to do. Um, but still gonna get this sauna done to try and like keep it warm, keep it, you know, keep it getting better so we're gonna go do that um but yeah that's that's the update for now um obviously i'll let you know how it goes i'll be there i'll take some videos but on my phone like it won't be nothing crazy um so you won't really see much of me in there um but yeah with that being said thank you for tuning into this video and uh, make sure you leave a like, comment, and subscribe if you're new. And I will definitely, definitely see you very soon. Peace. All right, ladies and gentlemen, as you can see, we are in the store. Turn you around, show you a little bit. Um, yeah, I've um, I've literally just finished getting my video up. Let me just. Wow, I feel like that's really close to me, but I don't really know. Can't tell you. Um, I've got the. I've got everything ready to go. Um, it's scheduled to come out. This is it here. And as you can see, it focuses. Deadlifting gone wrong. Plastic physique check. That's the. It's going to be the thumbnail. It's just going to be. Um, it's going to be me looking real depressed because I. It's literally what I look like after I finish deadlifting, knowing that I just injured my fucking self. Um, it only goes for seven minutes, so it's not really long, but that's because we got injured and couldn't fulfill our entire session. Um, but with that being said, I'll keep you updated if anything else keeps going on today. I'm going to obviously give you... So you know how in like my last video, one of my other videos, I told you, you know, what supplements should you be taking, well, it's good for you, blah, blah, blah. I'm going to do something similar, but a new style. I'm going to figure out which one I want to do, and then I'm going to video it. So be prepared, because that's probably coming up next. As soon as this is done, you're probably going to move straight into that. So, um, yeah, with that being said, I'll see you shortly. Let's go. All right. So let's talk about how to increase your metabolism. Get it to, get it to boost itself. Go faster, you know what I mean? So everybody's always like, oh, I eat healthy. I do this, I do that. But my, my metabolism's still slow. So, I'm gonna give you tips, a couple of tips, not, not, not too many, I don't really want to drag it out, but I want to give you a couple of tips that'll give you an idea on how to boost your metabolic rate. So the first thing I'm gonna talk about is physical activity. So, you've got you know, your strength training, your high intensity interval training or HIIT training, and regular aerobic exercise. So aerobic exercise is obviously like, you know, your running training, uh, swimming kind of training, cycling. It helps you burn calories and in increase overall energy expenditure obviously hit training they can increase your metabolic rate for hours after exercise due to the afterburn effect and obviously strength training building muscle through strength training can boost your resting metabolic rate since muscle tissue muscle tissue burns more calories than fat tissue that's tip number one tip number two is eating smaller but frequent meals so this way Steady energy levels, so eating smaller more frequently can help you keep your metabolism active and prevent large spikes and drops in your blood sugar levels. And also avoid overeating. Regular eating can prevent overeating at subsequent meals, which can then lead to gaining weight, which obviously we all want to avoid. So obviously, avo like avoiding the overeating process will help you, you know, have your metabolic rate increase. Tip number three is managing your stress. So obviously your cortisol levels, so chronic stress can increase cortisol levels, which can lead to fat storage and decrease muscle mass, 
muscle mass, mass, muscle mass, both of which can lead to a lower metabolism, and also mindfulness practices. So techniques like meditation, yoga, and deep breathing can help you manage your stress levels um, and can obviously, you know, well, it's obviously going to increase your metabolic rate, so I'm telling you this. But at the same time, sorry, so I thought somebody walked in the store. But at the same time, it's just going to keep you at peace. You're going to be less stressed all the time. You know, you don't, you don't really want to be stressed. You know what I mean? It's not going to help, especially when you're trying to eat, like diet, really, really. So you're cutting, you're trying to diet strictly. Stress ain't going to help you. So, yeah. Look, in conclusion, boosting your metabolism involves a combination of physical activity, proper nutrition, adequate hydration, a health, and healthy lifestyle habits. By incorporating these strategies into your daily routine, you can enhance your metabolic rate and support your overall fitness and health goals. So, take those tips, um, take those tips in. Do what you want with them, but I feel like if you want to, if you want to boost your metabolism or your metabolic rate, use these tips. There are some other ones, but those three are the ones I wanted to give you for now. So make sure you. Uh, Make sure you use them, but yeah, enjoy the rest of this video. I'm in my puffer jacket now because I got fucking cold standing here. The doors are open, so wind's just fucking blowing in. And I'm like, no way. So I'm gonna get my jumper. Um, but yeah, enjoy the rest of this video. Some more things coming. I'm going out tonight to some country festival thing. Um, so I'll get a few snippets of that, add it into the video, and then we can, uh, we can move on from there. But with that being said, I'll see you soon. Bro, honestly, like, I'm sitting here, I'm doing, like, some work and stuff. And I went and got a snack. Now, I know I'm cutting, but I was like, nah, I don't care. I'm a slut for chocolate. That nah, slut. These, they're so good. I don't know why. I don't know why they're so good. They're fucking phenomenal. I know I'm on a cut. It's not really ideal. <sighs> chocolate is just so fucking good. So I've decided to treat myself a little bit today. Um... Hopefully it doesn't backfire.